Hi guys, this is the uh, video for uh, the new LE style apron. We'll also show the Pro Upgrade style apron for your Iron Man from uh, Stern Pinball. Um, either the 2010 version or your 2014 L uh, VE version. Um, basically it's going to take you through a couple steps. The only thing I'm not going to show is how to plug in the, um, the power source which is on the right hand side right below your shooter. So in order to actually plug in the cord, which I'm going to show you just a, a version in just a little bit, you'd have to raise the play field. And on the right hand side, just below here, um, you're looking at a three pin connector. Looks just like that. Okay. You're going to plug the, the female into that. You'll still have retain your, uh, your, your splitter because that's already built into this long power cord. And it goes to a two pin which everything plugs into. So this is what your uh, basic stock apron is going to look like. I'm going to get it out of the box. It's going to be plastic. Um, it is what it is. So it's plastic and you can also um, reuse the plastic and we have a low cost version that matches our, our custom made pop bumpers. I'm going to show you what that looks like here in just a second. But the uh, emblem is a EL panel lit emblem. It's lit all the time whenever the machine's on, so it's a good attraction for other players or it just looks great. Um, so this is what you look like out of the box. Now if you follow the uh, video, which I have posted on my, on my channel, uh, Hooked1989, um, it shows all my mods also hooked on pinball.com. We'll have a link to it. But this is what you get out of the box. Basically, when you do that whole video, you'll peel this off, drill one hole, and there you have it. You have a little... Um, emblem, and like I said, it's constantly lit. I'll show you what it looks like. It's kind of hard to tell in these lights. I'll show you what it looks like in the dark, just like that. Okay, so that's the the pro plastic upgrade version. If you want to keep that, okay. If you don't, it's very simple. You take the nuts off here and here, okay, which are underneath the little scorecards. You take that off. You take off your lockdown bar. And you basically will lift this straight up. Now mine has the power cords, that this EL panel, because I've already done the upgrade. So we'll go ahead and unplug it. Okay, so that's unplugged. Now I'm going to take this off. Okay. Now when you remove your stock apron, you're going to have two little posts here and here. You just unscrew those, those come straight up. Okay, so then you're ready to go. You'll notice I've already installed my the uh, little footies here, which come in your kit, come with three screws and your little footie. Make sure that the angle goes upward because it's got to hold the arch in. Okay, and what you do is you place your LE apron on the play field, and you'll notice these little slots right here. I set it straight down in the little slots where it belongs, and you can mark where the openings are, and then you kind of know where to put the footing panel right here in here. Okay, so once those are done, you take your your uh, kit out. Everything's already plugged in in the kit. Okay, and everything on the back side is serviceable LEDs, and these come from Coin Taker. This is a flexible head um, 555. This is a warm 555. You can change it out if you want. Go ahead and feed everything down through the hole. Place it down the play field. I'm going to lift it up here in just a second. And you slide it back on. Now, when you slide it back on, I'm going to lean you forward here. You'll see the little footies right here. And over here. They poke outside that LE apron. Okay, that's what's going to hold you in place. Now, this would be lifted up, and there's a screw that goes here, which is in your kit, and here, which is in your kit. So, once you install those screws, you can actually lift this up and down and it won't move at all, okay? It's going to be just like the newer Stern LE Abrams. But for the source for this video, I'm just going to go a little fast. All right, so that's how you have it. Okay, that's what it looks like. Um, you're going to have, once it's lit up, you'll see that these are custom-made backlit uh, artwork. They don't wash out. They're made to be backlit. Um, I have them custom-made, and they're installed already. Lenses on top to, pr to protect them. And, of course, they're lit from the back side. So I'm going to go ahead and plug this in. Show you what it looks like. Lit up. 
And then I'm going to turn off the light so you can see it in action. Okay. What you'll see is, it's kind of hard to tell, so I'm going to go ahead and turn the lights off here in a second. Um, these two art areas are lit constantly, and they're also color changing. All right, so that gives this more active background, okay? And of course, your EL panel's lit whenever the, car, whenever the machine's on. So that's more like what it's gonna look like in your arcade. It's kind of hard to pick up the LEDs changing um, with the camera, the nature of the beast, but maybe you can catch it there. Okay, of course, same thing is going on here. He's changing. Okay, everything else is stable. All right, and that's the kit. So right now, the aprons are going to be on my website for about the same price as the ACDC apron that I have on there, and also the um, Elvis apron I'm putting on there. Elvis will be just a little bit less because it has a little less going on. Um, but these aprons are available now. They're only available in the black at this point. A lot of us have already upgraded our um, our trim to the candy, so that's why I went with black because it matches everybody. Um, we also sell the kit without the apron, with just your artwork and your wiring and everything like that. Um, you have to contact me for that hooked on pinball at outlook.com and if you have any questions let me know um, again hooked on pinball at outlook.com this machine has got all my other mods on it monger whiplash air assault drone the um, war machine with a cannon and of course the uh, new pop uppers thank you very much again hooked on pinball.com